What's up, YouTube? It's me, the Massive Mainer, coming back at you. All right, it's the end of week six. I'd say this is by far the, probably the most confusing week thus far. Last week, you guys know I put on two pounds to get up to 345. Wasn't happy about that. I think you can see it in the video. But um, that said, these are the questions that we answer. I'm going to put them down for a second while I shake the whole table. For me, this was about losing weight. For me, this was about breaking my bad habits with food. Because the reason why anybody would ever get to 372 pounds, which some of you guys don't realize, I was actually 395 two months before I was 372. Um, for me, this was about breaking my bad habits because if anybody ever weighs that much, it's because they eat like a fucking pig. Um, I just don't want to look at food like something to be enjoyed, but more like air, something you need, you know? Maybe air wasn't the best example, but kind of, you know? Just think of it like that, like if you want to grow muscle, you, you eat protein. You want to lose weight, you restrict your calories so on and so forth, you got a cold, you got vitamin C, you know. Um, that said, for me, this is about weight loss. I made the comment that uh, I was going to lose more weight than anybody has ever done before, and within five minutes there was a post from one of the guys who picked us saying, guys, this isn't about weight loss. So, I'm confused because right from the beginning, that's what it's been about for me. Now, there are other people in this competition that it couldn't, it couldn't be about just weight loss because they, they only look like they got 20 pounds. It could be about, you know, finding the best them, um, which is awesome because when I get to the part of, about exercise, you'll understand why I say that. <clears throat> okay, so now to the questions. Lipo 6, how has it affected me? Um, combined with the diet I was doing, it was like I was forgetting to eat altogether, <laughs> which honestly... I laugh at and I think it's awesome because that's the first time in my life I've ever been able to do that. Um, that, was, that, that was great. Um, energy wise through the roof and appetite control wise, excellent. It's like a plus five to a fucking fat loss. How has your diet been? Have you stuck with the deadline diet? If I were to stick with the deadline diet and do the equation that they gave us, I would be eating 4,064 calories, 300 and something from protein, 100... 238 from fat and 110 from carbohydrates. I don't know if I'd be able to lose weight at 4,000 calories. Um, maybe. Uh, if, I, if at all, it would be because um, I went above and beyond in the weight room or w wherever. Like, um, Which I, I, I will do. That's no problem. Um, I, just, I guess I kind of went at it with my cup mostly full, you know? Where I was like, okay, if I eat all my calories and respect the calories in versus calories out and eat good food. Um, I think the worst meal I had this time around was ribs that I bought from uh, the grocery store. Not like any kind of sauced up ribs, but just ribs I stuck into uh, um, the George Foreman and squished until all the fat was gone and then ate them. Um, <clears throat> that was probably the worst thing I ate this week. How has your workout regimen been? By far the best. I wake up in the morning, I do 25 push-ups, 50 sit-ups, 24 push-ups, 50 sit-ups, 23 push-ups, 50 sit-ups, and you see where I'm going, all the way down to one. 50 sit-ups every single time. Um, then I go to the Alfonso Youth Center three times a week and swim. Then I go to the gym seven times, six times a week and work out for three hours doing weight training, two to three hours. And uh, I superset, I do negatives, I do drop sets, I do to a failure. Um, I do, I, and I mix those together. I do to a failure and then do negatives. I do to a failure and then do a drop set. Um, Northern A, um, I give it everything I have. This is probably the first week I can honestly say I couldn't have done anything more. I have worked out so bad that people at the gym will comment on the sweat trail when I do walk-in lunges, will comment from the sweat trail and, and how it goes from the back door to the cardio. So that's good. So I was doing good at the deadline diet. Um, how has your overall mood been? I guess confused. Am I not supposed to lose weight now? Am I supposed to lose weight? Am, um, I, I don't know, you know. 
for me, it was always about losing weight. And uh, now it said it's, it's not about losing weight. I don't know. I'm very confused on that one. So I'm just going to put that one aside this week. Overall, how dedicated were you to the program this week? Could you have done more? I guess I couldn't have had ribs. I didn't realize ribs were so bad for you. I mean, I get, you know, like ribs from Arby's or, or uh, you know, some kind of fast food restaurant's bad for you or a restaurant period, but the way I had them, it wasn't anything, didn't even really taste that good. But that was okay because I was, I'm not addicted to food. I'm not, oh, it has to be the best tasting. Workout wise, I couldn't have done any better. No way. No way. There was times I felt like I was going to puke and that's when I felt the best because I knew I worked the hardest. Um, medicine wise, yeah, I probably, sometimes I, I, I forget to take certain CLA or certain carnitine or certain, uh, Lipo 6 Unlimited. Not purposely, it's just, you know, you're so busy with working out and your weight loss that sometimes you just forget to take stuff. That said, um, pretty good week. My inches went down big time. Um, my weight went from 345 to 338, I think it was 338.8, .8, so that's pretty good. That said, I hope everybody else does good. I know this isn't solely about weight loss because if it was, then there's people who, you know, what I could lose in a week would take them three weeks to lose, and that wouldn't be fair. But um, let me just end this with my goals. I'd like to be right around 290 pounds to 300 pounds when this is all said and done with. Uh, maybe 310 would be acceptable, but not something I would want to do. From there, I want to learn how to eat correctly and eat right. Calories in, calories out, I, with, uh, I, I, F, Y, M, if it fits your macros. I want to learn more about that stuff because uh, I do feel like I'm losing some muscle. And uh, I want to get to 310 and then stop my halt, halt my weight loss right there. And then continue to build muscle and maybe after six months go back at the weight loss again. Give my skin some time to adjust to where it's at. But all right, guys, I hope everybody else did well. Um, Sean, I hope you did well. You're, uh, you are a competitor, and that's awesome. Tim, I hope you did well. You are original and fucking hilarious. Warren, fuck me running, dude. The faces you make sometimes, my man, are just will light a day up. Dustin, you're smart, and you put in the effort, unreal. Samantha, aren't you a pretty little girl? I <laughs> know, but seriously, you work hard, too. Um, Natalie, she, uh, I don't think I've seen her on as much. I think we go on at different times. But still, I mean, if you watch her first picture to this picture now, unreal. And if I miss anybody else, not that I'm, I'm, I'm playing favorites. I just I go by what I see on the Lipo6 website. So, uh... Oh, Richard. Richard Riviera. Yeah, that guy's a beast, man. Fucking back. Uh, and Gene. Now, Gene, my man. That's my man. Dude does dumbbell curls for reps with 50. Awesome. <laughs> Alright, guys. Stay buff, New England. Ergo the world.